Gemini, what's up? It's Obsidian Lotus Cell. I'm here to do the daily for the 11th, 12th of May, 2021. Before we get into it, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, share your love and support. Also, if you'd like it personal, that information will be in the description box below, how to reach me, how to make a payment, etc. So Gemini, let's go ahead and get into it. Personals, again, this is for the collective of Gemini, so it's not gonna 100% resonate with everyone. I love it when it does. But it doesn't always. Uh, personals are geared more towards your personal situation. Okay, so spirit, angels, ancestors, guides, what messages do we have for my lovely Geminis today? I feel like a lot of up and down energy, and I'm not trying to be funny, in Gem Gemini. <laughs> okay, so uh, we've been up and down lately here, okay? Um, there's something here in a situation that you need foresight on or you're looking for foresight on, okay? Spirit is saying go get in nature. Put your feet in the grass. Um, meditate. Get into nature. Uh, because, again, when you meditate, pray, pray um, your ancestors will give you those mes messages. Look, messages. Messages <laughs> that you're looking to receive. It's almost retrograde, y'all. It's two weeks before, and I still already can't even talk. Um yeah, and it's in Gemini, isn't it? Right? Okay, so anyway, am I confused? I don't know. All right, we'll talk about that later. Message. Message, okay? From your angels. Get into nature. They're trying to talk to you. You're not listening. Okay, is what I'm hearing. So let's do the Romance Oracle cards. Or you just need to get somewhere quiet enough to listen. There we go. Um, getting to, I know Geminis don't like being told they're not listening. <laughs> All right, getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So getting to know your partner, your new person, okay? What other energy do we have coming in? Um, playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to, to uh, fun to shine. So with these showing up, this is saying to me, get into this lighthearted, playful energy. Um, get to know someone. Keep it light though, okay? Fun. You do have unity coming in. So if you're single, you're not gonna be single for long, okay? Um, spirit, angels, ancestors, guys. Somebody sees you as a very ambitious, um, determined person, okay? So, could be a boss. Seven of Cups, you've got choices though. Emotional choices to make possibly here coming in. Um, and then being recognized financially, yeah. So I feel like somebody's boss, your boss might be watching you here. This is gonna make you really happy. Some energy coming in or information coming in. Um, could be involving Leo energy as well, but I feel like whatever hard work and determination is gonna pay off for you, Gemini. Six of Pentacles, the death card. Um, you might be receiving a gift here unexpectedly from a Scorpio energy, um, luck, okay, or there's something about having um, redistribution of energy in regards to something here that has ended here, okay, so um, death and transformation, something ending, something beginning. All right, you're going to have a lot of good luck here with the finances. Ace of Pentacles. Um, you could have Scorpio in your chart as well or be dealing with a Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Scorpio financially because Scorpio also had a lot of luck with money right now. King of Wands. There's a lot of action here, though, being taken here. High Priestess. I feel like uh, Gemini... This is going to be a very empowering energy for you, but I feel like you need to take action and trust your intuition here um and with a king of cups kind of uh there's some a feminine energy here aquarius libra gemini energy i feel like that's you um that has a tendency to be impulsive here with words speaking something here okay truth um but i feel like spirit is saying keep that under wraps okay be a little bit more understanding especially in and yeah boundaries the devil energy here conflict five of swords deceptive energy and clarity. I feel like there's something here. If you're up and battling somebody here for a promotion, watch your mouth at work, okay? Don't say shit this week or next week or whenever, all right? Um, because you're about to get something and somebody might be mad, yeah. All right, so wait on that shit. Two wands, you've got unity coming in. Um, 
union coming in, but you've also got energies watching you in a tower energy, all right? Um, because somebody's trying to fuck up your happiness, basically. Libra energy and justice. A Libra that you walked away from wants to successfully fuck up your life. You need to, you need to, uh, if it's a restraining order boundary or just create some boundaries or a level of understanding here with this energy, boundaries, boundaries, showing up twice, battling. You need to put somebody in check here, Gemini. And sometimes people just need to be told, right? It's like, you. sometimes people just need to be told, hey, I see what the fuck you're doing and I don't like it and I don't appreciate it and I'm not gonna tolerate it in my life because some people think that people just don't see it, right? They can get away with being passive aggressive, manipulated, manipulative, something here and I don't know. I feel like maybe there's a big age gap between you and this person's energy and you could be wanting to change partners. Maybe you're very generous to this person here and that's just the whole issue altogether, okay? So um, what are their energies? Again, tower energy, this is a warning, Gemini. You've got tower coming in with what? Somebody that has not given up hope in a situation with you. Libra. The four of wands. They're taking action because they're they're afraid you're going to move in with somebody. What the hell? Okay. Seven of pentacles. So you want freedom, period. I mean, most Geminis do. All right. So maybe this person was very... Uh, controlling or I don't know. All right. So we've got this nine of pentacles, energy, gratitude. So we have an energy. Yeah. We've got a mentor, a boss coming in. that's very grateful for, uh, what you've been doing. You've got expansion here going, coming in with this. And then the seven of wands energy, protected energy, but also protect your energy again. Um, success, six of wands again, Wheel of Fortune, Fate, Destiny, Change in Partner, Change in Job. It could be a new job offer. Lovers, Gemini. Clarity. Okay, yeah. So, Clarity, your prayers are being answered here. Okay. Now, I feel like it could be involving an Aquarius energy, but there is a level here of, uh, there's an Aquarius Six of Pentacles that you're not giving to anymore that is trying to find a way to get back in with you as well. Ten of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. If an Aquarius comes back for a commitment, it's all about money. Period. Um, Ten of Cups. Yep. And then the Emperor energy with the Ten of Cups. So somebody who's willing to do whatever it takes for money. What other energy do we have coming in? the devil boundaries create boundaries you got to create boundaries in this situation it looks like um trust your intuition about what somebody who has not lost hope in a situation air sign watching spying gossiping communication coming in and then secrets coming out with the moon card four of wands and the truth about what really went down and as far as something with a job and a home situation. All right, Gemini. Um, I just see, it feels like you're trying to avoid all this mess. All right, what's the final outcome for Gemini? You've got to take action on something, not keep shit coming up. Ten of Pentacles, something involving a child marriage and a commitment and then your happiness secrets coming out and then communication involving those secrets with a sagittarius energy temperance 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 and then mental conflict all right so virgo manipulative energy hangman energy stock energy the emperor again seven of wands and then being like very defensive yeah so i feel like this message is loud and clear focus on your money focus on your money you've got drama um the emperor okay you're going after and this is high vibe emperor stuff right status right so you got people here and choices as far as love is concerned but you got a lot of 
if it looks like you have some good opportunities or good luck here, rebirth. Okay, Spirit is saying it's, it's new, 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 new. You're protected, successful here with the wands. Okay, you're gonna have, you could possibly have success with a Scorpio, but this is the energy of new, a rebirth of a situation, a rebirth of transformation, going through the dark night of the soul, starting all over. Keep your head on straight, because it looks like you got some energies around you that don't have theirs on straight, and you don't, it doesn't, I mean, that aren't coming in for good reasons either, okay? So, um, hold on to this determination, okay? I think that's what I'm going to leave it, where I'm going to leave it for you, Gemini. Let's draw a couple more cards really quick. I don't, I don't read for you guys that often, but I felt compelled to read for you really quick today. Spirit angels, ancestors, guides, if somebody needed that message, please help me provide Gemini with any messages you would like for them to receive. Let's do four, career. All right, see, new things are taking off with your career. Focus, okay? It's time right now, in May, right now, right? Like I just said, time to act. Oh my God, loud and clear messages, okay? And then wreath. You will have so sorrow over a loss, or this is what's been going on. But I do have a feeling like it's more like letting go of some past crap um, relationship-wise that wasn't good for you. Yeah, someone working against you and behind your back. You're being protected. Um, spiritual guidance, protection from harm, and then great happiness with a harp. Okay, so lots of love and lights to you. Lights. <laughs> Light. Oh, guys. Uh, until next time, bye.